So it's been a while since I've seen you and a lot has happened. You know we go to Tantra events. Well, we're around a lot of couples who are very open. And sometimes this is really hard for me because I think, oh my God, they're going to have sex with me. And I just don't do that. But it's been good for us as a couple too because we've been together a long time. And you know how couples, they're together a long time, they get bored, they cheat, and they even split up. So, this year, I let my partner go on a trip without me. I gave him full permission to do whatever he wanted with whoever he wanted, as long as he didn't have sex. Sure enough, when he came back, he had had an intimate connection with someone. And this is what I would never have imagined. He wanted to go on seeing her. And that's when I went schizo. Because part of me felt like he wants to have sex with someone else and that's just wrong. Or if I'd been a better partner, maybe this would never have happened. The other part of me felt like this could be a possible doorway to unconditional love and even enlightenment. But I know what you're thinking. You're thinking I'm letting him have an affair. But it's way more complicated than that. Aha! I have control. Your love is away from you. Where is he? I have opened my heart and let him give and receive love from another. So. What do you think they're doing right now? I don't think it serves me to dwell on the details and speculate. No, that's my specialty. I can imagine all kinds of yummy things for you that would make you jealous, no? No. When we parted, he assured me of his love. I am always in his heart. He's not thinking of you now, is he? I hope not. I hope he's lost in the beauty of the moment. Give me a break! What are you? Some kind of a saint. It's killing you, this whole thing. I have a higher goal. I'm giving a gift. The gift to love freely. And what could this world need more? You're doing this for world peace. And what are you getting out of this noble act of sacrifice? I don't see it as a sacrifice. The more he is loved, the more I'm loved in return. So, you're just enduring this because of what you'll get. Not exactly. This will nurture our relationship. But there's always a little pain with growth. So, you admit you're in pain. I am not always in control of my emotions. That's true. They're part of my journey, part of who I am. Just as you are, lower self. So come out of the shadows. Let me see you. I know what you look like. Good luck. <sighs> I may be crazy. And I have no idea how this thing is going to turn out. But it's something that I must do for myself and for my relationship. 